Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Taurians. What's up, my loves? Welcome back to your love reading for the month of November. We're going to do a love reading in regards to the person energies that you are around, all right? Or just love in general. But first, we want to start with a monology card here to check in towards with your higher self to see what messages, spirit, source, your angels, your ancestors, your spirit guides has for you. And then we're going to shift the energies a little bit towards and jump into the energies or summon in the energies around you. All right. To see how they feel towards you during this time. And then we're going to finish up, stick around. We're going to pull some tarot cards to see how your person feels in regards to this connection or get some further clarification with the tarot cards, my loves, all right? Now, the readings here may resonate for sun, moon, rising, Venus, north or south, no placements, okay? Also, cross watchers, welcome, my loves. You are welcome here as well, all right? So thank you, source, angels, ancestors. Let's jump into Taurus energy. Protect my space as I channel the messages here for Taurus placements. Ashe. Ashe. All right, Ashe. Let's move forward here. Let's start by, with some moonology cores, Taurus. Let's see what your emotions over there feeling like. Let's see what spirit source has for you. What are the messages? What do you need to know, Taurus? My sexy ass Taurus. What do you need to know? Ooh, it's time to take action, my loves, all right? It's time to take action. New moon in Aries, all right? Some of y'all may have Aries placements in your chart as a fire sign, all right? Or just needed to jump in that Aries energy, all right? And take action. It's time to take action action so in regards to whatever this is taurus okay you need to take action right your higher self all right you need to take action in regards to whatever this is that you are procrastinating i'm hearing and referencing to whatever this is that you've been thinking about you've been wanting to manifest here all right it's time now to take action that's very significant, okay? So whatever this is, you know exactly what this is that you need to take action towards, towards, okay? All right, thank you, source, angels, ancestors. Let's move forward. Let's see what are the energies around you, all right? Let's see how they are feeling towards you, towards this situation, towards this circumstance. What is standing out the most, source? What did this person need to know? source what do my divine feminine divine masculines my tarzans need to know in reference to this energy or this person that is around Taurus during this time this is the raw tarot deck this is where we're going to get messages from your person and how they truly feel all right rather they told you or not Taurus. so let's see let's see what they have to say with the raw tarot deck here <clears throat> wow, damn, Gina, right out the gate, Taurus, we got haters right out the gate, you know what I say, you know what Cat Williams say, if your ass ain't got over 50 haters by summertime, bitch, then you ain't doing your job, so Torin, you doing your motherfucking job, alright, not only do you have people that love you genuinely, all right, that appreciate you genuinely, you got to have balance, all right, thank you, source, you got to have balance, all right, so we got haters, and we got other energies that love you genuinely, so you doing your job, Taurus, don't be mad, don't be ashamed of that, don't be irritated by that, shit, I love it, okay, look, because that let me know I'm doing my damn job, if I got people hating on me, and I know I'm spreading the light, I know I'm being of the highest light. I know I ain't in your motherfucking business. I know I ain't bothering you, bitch. And you over here hating on me, bitch. Then I'm doing my motherfucking job. Okay? That means I'm doing and touching others. And you got a problem with it. Mm, 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 mm. 
Well, fuck some shit up, Taurus. That's what the fuck I'm talking about. You need to take action. Spirit telling you, regardless if you got haters or not, bitch, you take action. Fuck them and fuck what they got to say. That means you doing your job. It's definitely time for you to take action. When you got energies around you that don't want to see you make it, that don't want to see you progress, bitch, you take action on that ass. You take action on them. Let them know what the fuck a real boss is about. What the fuck? Moving forward, what else we have in regards to these energies or the people that is surrounding Taurans? What else is going on? <clears throat> Look. Mm-hmm. I like it so far, okay? Somebody ain't got something to say. They don't want to talk, Taurus. They don't want to talk. Ooh, they want to talk, though. I fucking love you. Wow, Torin. Okay. Listen up. We got somebody out here that not only do they love you, okay, they fucking love you. When I made this card, I was like, mm, 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 mm. They fucking love you. You hear me? Somebody out there fucking love your guts, okay? They just fucking love you all over the fucking place. I'm hearing, damn, y'all be fucking shit up all over. Okay, moving forward. <clears throat> Let me have myself. Let me, uh, I got to tank my scorpion energy. Hold on. Uh, all right. So look here. I knew it. I knew it. So you got some fuckery energies over here, Taurus, and you got some energies over here that want to fuck you up, okay, in a more <laughs> spiritually, uh, let's see, attractive or sexual, okay? We got some sexual, ooh, I heard sexual healing. Fuck it up, Taurus, with your freaky asses. Not only do you got some haters over here, some hater okay, but you got some energies over here that want to fucking... Do some goddamn soul healing. Okay. You need to tap into your higher self. You missing that over there in that spiritual realm. Because what I'm feeling over here in my aura. Okay. You got some energies that's trying to fuck some shit over there in the spiritual realm. Or you already over there fucking some shit up in the spiritual realm. I'm just saying, Taurus. What the fuck? What I'm over here feeling in my aura intuitively here. That's some sexual energy there. That's some intimate energy intimate to see okay Ooh, let me move forward y'all are always in some shit towards god damn what else do we have let's do one more car you know i like things that come in motherfucking threes okay what else besides the hating ass energy here and this person that fucking love you and fucking love you all over the place y'all be fucking some shit up all over the place towards i'm not the fly on the wild but i'm just saying I'm going to speak and channel out what I'm feeling in my aura. And I'm feeling some sexual energy here. Okay? I'm just going to keep it a buck 50. All right? Damn, look. You made me do it. Okay? So, referencing to this person, the energies that is around you, whatever that just went down between you two. Okay? You made me do it. All right, so this person feel like you made me do it, whatever that is. Okay, I don't know. I said again, Tori. I feel like somebody asked me. I wasn't the fly on the wall. Okay, if I was a fly on the wall, Tori, I would have got all them details for you. That's why I'm here doing this. I don't tap in the spiritual room, so I'm gonna give it to you this way. Now, damn it. All right, until I get over there and astro project over there. Torrens, then I'll let you know. Okay? Now, at the bottom of the deck, we have, I only wanted you. Wow, okay? I only wanted you, Taurus. So, this person that you are around, alright, or been exchanging your energies with, they only wanted you. Okay? Rather, if there were haters involved, Taurus, this person, the energy that you are around, Okay, I'm hearing your significant other or this significant other. They only wanted you, all right? So some of y'all may have more people involved or more energies involved or trying to be involved in this connection or this relationship, okay? And unfortunately, there are haters there, okay? They have to be there to do their job, to test you, Taurus, and this person out to see if 
it is a divine connection all right so i'm gonna say that because whatever the energy here that you made me do it here taurus all right they fucking love you all right they fucking love you not just love you taurus but they fucking love you wow so let's get some tarot cards out here let's see what is going on with the energies of the haters here Taurus, and let's see what is the energies here and deep and dive a little bit more into i fucking love you and see what this energy in person is all about i feel here and see with my own two eyes Taurus. okay I see you here. I'm the fly here right now in your video, in your reading tours. So what I see here, okay, so eyes may be very significant for you, all right, or you're needing to use your eyes to see more. I'm here to see more through the veil, all right, so some of you are needing to look further through, all right, deep, more deep into this connection or this relationship, all right, you needed to see with your eyes, all right. <clears throat> but however, looking here, I am seeing towards that you have energies that are not happy for you. Not happy in regards to what you have. Whoever this is that you're giving your love towards, your energy, your time, your thoughts, your feeling towards. There are other energies outside of you that are intuitive as fuck as well. And they're picking up on whatever this is or they're seeing with their eyes towards the connection, the way that you are presenting. Thank you, spirit, yourself. Wow. All right. Thank you, source. Let's jump into the energy. So let's get some tarot cards out here. Again, thank you for the ones that are new here. Thank you for the ones that's been here with me since day one. All right. If so far you are enjoying the reading or my energy, okay, don't forget to hit that like button. Show spirit source some love. All right, and again, if you're new here, welcome. Subscribe, be a part of family where we love and we evolve together. All right, and we grow. We spiritually grow here on this channel and we have fun, right? And definitely hit that notification bell, my love, so that way you can be notified for when your readings are available, okay? And also to my members, my memberships, okay, by Evolving Spirits, the real Evolving Spirits, okay? And also to my Evolved Souls and my Immortal Evolved Souls. <clears throat> my loves, don't forget to hit the notification bell as well, so that way you're notified for your private readings and our private live streams, okay? Thank you again for your love and support to my membership tribe. All right, and if you would like to become a membership, my loves, you can hit that join button there and you will see the options and the tiers that are available for you if you want to engage more with me, all right, if you want to spend more time with me, right, you can select a membership there as well to be a part of the real evolving spirits or the soul evolved spirits there or the immortal, okay, it goes down over there in the immortal um, <clears throat> tier, or I'm going to say for, again, my divine immortal, all right, souls we do live stream videos that are privately all right and we also do live videos and readings all right so yes definitely see what best floats your boat or where you want to engage with me more and spend more time with me if you enjoy the energies here on the channel and also just simply as i always keep availability there for my subscribers okay again for the ones that's been riding this boat and rocking it with me since day one i still keep up with the community tab for you i provide daily enlightenment over there all right and we have our live streams here as well but it gets very deep Okay, it's it's more time with the memberships. I'm gonna be honest about that. There's more time of me giving there. I spend more time with you on a more personal level. So just see what you know, what you like, what you want to get engaged with, where your spiritual growth is, and where you want to go. Okay, moving forward. So now let's tap into 
these energies here. Let's see what is really going on, Taurin. Okay, let's see what the haters is all about here. Let's let's jump into that first, shall we? All right, okay. Let's see what you're doing right, because you're doing it right over here. You fucking some shit up, Taurus. So let's see what these haters got going on. Let's see where they need some spiritual growth there. Because we know haters need spiritual growth when they draw into your energy, Taurus. Okay, and they hating for no damn reason. All right, let's see where they spiritual growth needs to be the fuck at. Let's see what they need to enlighten their asses up on, okay? Let's see if we can put the light and the fire up under that ass. Okay. Ooh. Mmm. Hold on, spirit. All right, I just got the eight of swords here, and I'm getting messages as the card poured out, Torin. Okay. Look, okay, this card, I heard guilty. All right, so this person know that they are guilty. Is why I said, mm, when I pulled the card, I said, hold on, spirit. All right, so this person, this hater here, Taurus, they know that they're guilty, okay? They know what they done was not for the highest light or not for them higher selves. It was a decision here that was made from them lower selves that whatever they done towards you, Taurus, all right, or even if this is your person, all right, that I am speaking amongst here or the energies, again, that are outside of you. They know that they're guilty for whatever that they've done towards you, all right, and they're hating on you, all right. And now, wow, I'm getting, and now they're making up excuses here to say that you made them do it. This is some fucked up shit. Hold on, Taurus. Hold on, Spirit. Let me just tap in here. Let me step down in the 3D realm. Uh, let me get up out of the spiritual realm for just a second and give you my opinion, Taurus, if you don't mind. All right? But that's fucked up. Okay? It's some crazy-ass energies down here in this damn planet. I'm just going to keep it a buck fit. And I'm noticing that more and more of myself, Taurus, every day. Shit, fuck. My North Node is a Taurus. I have to live in this shit. Okay? So this shit, look... <laughs> It just lets you know what frequency and vibration you're on and what you're having to deal with, okay? Until you can bounce up, up off that bitch, all right? What the sad part is, you got haters, all right? That not only are there haters, Taurus, but the fact that they don't even want to own up to the own shit that they fucking do. So they rather sit here and put their arms out and make you feel that they feel and want you to feel sorry and guilty for their motherfucking asses when they can pull that bear right off the fuck of their own goddamn eyes and from around their own goddamn arm and risk but they rather blame your ass they rather fucking blame you Taurus and say you made me fucking do it you better go kick your own ass and build your own motherfucking self up and woman up or man up to your own shit now that would turn me the fuck on when you can man up woman up to your own shit then take action bitch and do what you claim you want then we can get somewhere in life, right? Okay? Then we can get somewhere in life, right? So when this person can get out and get the head out their own ass, okay, and realize the own shit they did, because I'm only messaging, I'm only channeling out what spirit is calling me to do and what the fuck I see with my own two motherfucking eyes, okay? Because <clears throat> I'm bouncing between both worlds. I'm up here in the spiritual realm, and I'm tapping down here talking to you, Tori. And let me tell you what I see in the 3D fucking realm. What I see in the 3D fucking real, and this is, excuse my language, this is a pussy, all right? They're pump, all right? They can't even woman up or man up to their own shit. You don't want to be around no energy like this. Keep them motherfuckers where they at, okay? That's what I do. Keep they asses where they at. They ain't no good for you. They ain't going to be able to prosper for you. They ain't going to be able to allow shit to progress. If anything, they're just going to eat your pockets and take all your goddamn energy. All right, because this is the type of energy that they don't want to man up to their own shit. So what the fuck you think they gonna man up or woman up to your ass? And they can't even take fault their own shit that they project out on you. All right, and that's sad, but that's what haters do when they don't want to blame themselves, when they don't want to take the blame, but they see you doing it. Okay, and ooh, that just tingled my motherfucking aura. That's the shit that I'm attracted to and turn me the fuck off. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, moving forward. So these hating ass energies, rather this is a feminine energy or a motherfucking masculine energy, keep they asses where they at. 
and you run as fast as you fucking can and you run towards this person that fucking love you towards because again on the flip side we have a positive energy here we have a more energy of the highest light because my energy is switching all of a sudden so i know i'm very intuitive as intuitive as fuck okay so what i'm fucking feeling over here okay i made these cards so i know exactly what the energies are here and this energy right here this shit right here this shit right here nigga this shit right here come through cat williams okay they fucking love you. This is where, where you want to be at. Fuck this energy here or energies, okay? Tell them to kiss your ass, all right? All right, moving forward. Let's see what else, Spirit. Let's get one more energy. Now that we know this person or these energies are guilty, because this is a guilty card for me. This is the Eight of Swords, okay? This is this person when they know, all right? They're realizing, they're recognizing, they're wrong, they're fault. But they still choose to be in this energy when they can move around. She has plenty of space here to come up out around from these swords and all the guilt and things or that has transpired and that she has done in her life. And know that she played a part in it. She can easily pull these veils off to see the truth, to look in the mirror herself. But, Taurus, she chooses not to. All right? So, again, even if I'm talking to the person that you're in a relationship with, now you got an understanding of what the fuck you need to do. All right? Or if these people are around you. Or, fuck, Taurus, if this is you. All right? It's time to look at yourself in the mirror. It's time to look at these people in the mirror. It's time to, because they're a reflection of you outside of you. All right? So if you need to go back in and look at yourself and see what you are around or what it is that you are dealing with around you, you need to take a step back and ask yourself, is this the type of energy I want to continue to be around? Or you need to look at this person, if this is a person you're in a relationship with or you are around, is these the type of people I want to hang around? They're going to keep your ass lost, broke, and confused. Okay? I'm just saying. Been there, done that, got the t-shirt. All right? So let them hate. Keep them hating ass energies where they at. Let them do their job. You continue to have the strength and the courage. And you move the fuck on. Okay? And you go towards whatever this love over here that is surrounding you as well. I feel like this person or these energies over here are keeping you up afloat, all right? Right, it's a new person that you're dating, talking to, right? These are fuck family members, okay, that love you genuinely, all right? Or a person over here that loves you genuinely. This is where the fuck you need to be because the more you be around this energy, it's going to pull your ass down in the dirt. You're going to go quicker six feet under than what you realize. I'm just saying, I'm, I'm speaking facts over here. Uh, motherfucker, I, I speak reality. Thank you, spirit. I'm going to trigger your ass, get that fire up under your ass, and you'll thank me later. The truth may hurt now, but it's going to fucking set your ass free. You better believe it. You better believe it. Damn. Ooh, emperor energy here. Divine masculine. Yes, somebody sees you as their wish for fulfillment, or you see somebody as their wish for fulfillment as yours. Okay? And some of y'all... We have Divine Masculine coming out here, Divine uh, Feminine, okay? If I'm speaking with the Divine Feminine, we have Divine Masculine Energy here, all right? Coming out here, the Emperor, all right? Bye bye. Go within, okay? I'm seeing the Two of Swords making a decision here. It's time, my loves. As Spirit said, it's time to take action, all right? It's time to take action. All right, so let's see. Let's move forward here. Let's get more clarification in regards to the Eight of Swords. Why do we have the Eight of Swords here, Spirit? Why do we have the Eight of Swords here for Taurus? Wow, we have the Nine of Pentacles, my loves. Okay, this is telling me some of y'all may be single, okay, or you are in a single state mindset, okay, and some of you all are saving, all right, you're saving your funds. Bear with me one moment. That's my daughter calling me. Bear me one moment, my loves.
sorry, my loves. My apologies, Torrens. My daughter has awoken. It's early 30 around here, okay? So I have to get her situated, all right? So again, as we were channeling out here for you, the Nine of Pentacles, Torin. okay? So in regards to this person here, some of you all, this person is guilty of, you know, stating that they are single or being in a single state of mind, all right? And also some of y'all, this person may have been saving up or saving funds behind your back, okay? Or these energies see that you are as well becoming very successful here, being in the Nine of Pentacles energy, okay? That you are taking care of yourself and they do not like that. That man said, I'm not trying to tap into your reading and interrupt it again, okay? I know we're longer than what I normally channel messages out here, but this is very highly speaking for whoever this is for. This is very significant, okay? So I'm going to channel the messages out, rather there is a time frame here or not, Taurus, okay? I do believe in getting the message out here, all right? And somebody just hate on the simple fact that you are doing you, you're taking care of yourself, and you're fucking wanting better for yourself. So you decide to save up and do what it is that you need to do. For some of you, I'm getting as a father or as a mother. What the fuck? You hating on this person just because they sitting here trying to do better for themselves and they seeds? This definitely ain't the energy. I heard Leo. Okay, some of you on this person may be a Leo. You may have Leo highly placed in your chart or as a rising or as a moon. Okay, or Venus, however. But however, some of y'all, this person might be a Leo. Or the, the the person that's hating on your ass might be a fucking Leo. Okay, I'm just saying. Take it where it resonates. All right, I'm getting a lot of messages for you. But however, leave this person where they're at. If they're going to still be hate on you because you're taking care of yourself. Okay, I want to say Leo again. All right, Taurus. Now, because I know, I know what reading I'm on, okay? So there's highly a Leo around, or some of y'all, this person may have Leo placements in their chart, all right, um, that is in this energy of hating on you, all right, for no reason, because you want better for yourself. That's normal, okay? So again, haters, spirit is saying, that's normal, all right? So some of y'all, this may bother you that you have haters, or this may have been bothering you, okay? Baby, leave their asses where they at. When I, look, been there, done that, got the t-shirt, all right? Because I used to wonder, like, damn, why so many people hate on what I do, right? When I know I'm changing lives, when I know I'm waking people to fuck up, when I know I'm doing my calling and my purpose. But I have to realize as well, Spirit allowed me to realize that the light attracts darkness, okay? Again, the light attracts darkness right you can be that bug that light bug and everything around you was dark until that light stepped in the building or that light switch came on so you are a light switch touring okay people know that even the haters even the haters know that Taurus is why they have to hate okay so when you see it that way you congratulate your fucking self you smile bitch because I do and I laugh because I'm goofy like that. I can't help it. I'm a whole saggy as well. All right. So to say that, you know, this, this, I give myself a pat on the back. I get the clapping, bitch, because that mean that lets me know. Okay. That lets me know what I'm doing. Right. And how I'm impacting not only the ones that love me genuinely, but the fucking ones that's hating on you as well. It is what it is. You got to have both. People got to understand that we have the highest light. We have the white. We have the black. The darkness. We have both. And you have to have both. You have to love your shadow side of you. Your lower self. And you have to love your higher self. You have to love all of you. That's you. That's your spirit. That's your soul. Now, you do have your free will to be on what side of the rim you want to be on. Okay? Now, moving forward. Let's now tap out of that. Now we know what that bullshit was all about. Let's jump into this love energy over here. Let's just pull this energy all the way off of the board and keep their hating asses to the side. And knowing the fact spiritually, don't hire yourselves, we need to take action. And knowing the fact physically down here that you got some fucking love 
on the other side, on the higher part of the realm and perspective for you. So let's see what this energy is all about, Taurus, okay? And then we'll finish up your reading, my loves, okay? And thank you again for the ones that stuck around. Sorry for the interruption there with my little one there. I love you all so much. I love you, I love you, I love you. And if you love me so much, okay, hit that like button there. Give me some support there so we can allow this channel to expand and touch more of the ones that's in the darkness and that need that light as well. Okay. All right, Spiwet. Who is this person that fucking love my Torian? Who is this that's loving my toy sand over there? Who is this, Spiwet? What do they want to talk about? Oh my goodness, you guys are going to make me cry. Oh my goodness, Taurus. <sighs> Excuse me. It's another thing to read the cards, to channel out the messages through source, my higher self, right? But it's a blessing. It's a gift. Thank you, Spirit, to be able to feel how these cards and energies that are behind these cards when they come out through my aura. All right. It's beautiful that I that I'm able to feel how this person is feeling towards you, towards or feeling towards this connection right now through my aura. You get me? All right. But my, 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 the same way they are looking at each other in their eyes at each other is the same way towards this person you you two are feeling towards each other the fucking lovers okay some of y'all this person could be a gemini or have gemini placements in their chart all right i'm hearing moon all right some of y'all this person may have gemini in their moon or you may have gemini in your moon sign i don't know all right i'm just speaking what i'm hearing as well all right but however the lovers all right, this person is choosing you, Taurus, or vice versa, Taurus, you choosing this person. All right, but this is definitely a spiritual connection. All right, this is someone from your past, as in your life path, as in your past life. Thank you, Spirit, because you see the birds down here. All right, birds, ducks, whatever. You see the energy, the human, okay? You two are on a spiritual love connection this ain't just no oh i love you type of shit this is a spiritual connection there that spiritual connection where you be like i don't understand how we feel this way how is that we're connected i don't know what it is that you do to me how do you do this to me how do you make me feel this way it's your spirit baby okay it's your spirit it's connected through the ether and you two have lived past lives and past lives and past lives and past lives together multiple of times is why this person again what feels this way and that they fucking love you this is not a normal love all spiritual connections are not normal they're spiritual they're infinite thank you nothing or nobody or even hating ass energies will ever be able to come between this no matter how long you two or how little you two be around each other it will never stop it you guys will continue to come back here wherever you go next to a different planet for all we know right you will always meet each other in between halfway all right each time you evolve your person this person will evolve each time they evolve. You, Taurus, will evolve. This shit goes on for eons and eons and eons to go. Wow. Beautiful. Let's pull one more card and we'll finish up here, Taurus. Again, my loves, if the reading resonated so far with your spirit, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that joy button. Let's engage on a more deeper level because, oh my goodness, Taurus, okay? Okay? And let's stay connected because, oh my goodness, this person is definitely staying connected with you, Torin. Okay. The Six of Pentacles here. Need I say any more? There is even give and take here. All right. You're putting the pinnacle in, they're putting the pinnacle in. Right. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. The cars and the energy is just matching up. 
I like to put things out in the forefront for energies to get a, a visual as well. It's very important for your eyes. Okay, eyes is very important in this reading that has stamped out several times through my higher self. Your eyes is very important. So what you see with this person, what you're needing to see with this person, Spirit is saying, you need to see not only with the way how you feel or your aura, even Taurus or this person's aura, they're, re they're recognizing that they're looking and seeing with their eyes now. Maybe they were blind at one point in time. Maybe they didn't want to see. Or maybe, Taurus, you didn't want to see. But now, Spirit is asking you, telling you, use your eyes. All right? Look at what the fuck is in front of you. Okay? This is what's in front of you. An energy that fucking love you or energies that love you and want to give you even give and take. They ain't going to allow you to go broke. This type of energy, you're going to evolve. You know this person. Some of y'all been with this person before. Some of y'all are now realizing that. All right? But however, this is an energy that's going to give you even take. This is an energy that is going to be there, I'm hearing, in the long run. All right? Six of, we know six of pentacles energy. That's all about feminine energy. That's all about abundance. That's all about wealth. All right? Come on now. Look, baby. Stick to it, okay? And take action towards in regards to this person in this connection, in regards to whatever this is that you're manifesting, okay? Because there's definitely an energy here from your past life that is here now, okay? And they are wanting to, again, reunite, all right? Because you once reunited with this person before in your past, okay? And again, I feel like this person is now realizing that, you are now realizing that, but there is definitely a union here coming for the ones that's not in the relationship or this person may not be around, but you could just intuitively feel this person through music, all right, or feel that something is coming towards your way. It's your soulmate, my loves. It's the energy that you dealt with in the past or in the past life once before, all right? Why? Because they fucking love you. Why? Because they want to give you even balance, even take. All right? They want to put the same pentacle over here that's over here. Okay? I'm just saying. And why confirmation? Because they only wanted you. All right? Or you only wanted this person. Whoever shoes you in on whatever side of fence you're on, Taurus, is beautiful. I love it. All right? Always remember, my loves. That's the end of your reading. But always remember, your health is your wealth. If you two are not taking care of your health, you're not going to be able to more and more come into realization and open up your third eye of each other. Start working on yourself. The more you're loving yourself, the more this person is going to love themselves. The more you two are going to love each other. It starts there. All right? Open those eyes, Taurus, okay? See, all right? I love you, Taurus. That has completed your reading here for this week. Check in with your girl next week. Again, like, subscribe. Hit that join membership tab. Let's get to know each other more on a personal level. Let's engage more. Okay, let's enjoy each other energy more. All right, and let's kick it. Okay, and let's chill Ah, Okay, so this person, wanna, let me get up out of here. Let's settle down. This person loves you, my love, okay? And I don't want it to. They want to chill, for sure, okay? Y'all stop pulling on my energy. I feel y'all pulling me. Let me get up out of here. Okay, let me get up out of here. I got to go to the next reading. I love you, Taurus. Bye-bye.